Good morning, folks. Um, we're back on the field. Even though <clears throat> we all knew the season is closed, um, they've opened it again. So there's an extended season, which uh, which allows us to come out for another two months. But um, yeah, it's good now. But uh, it doesn't matter. Um, it's the best now. If you come this time, March. Um, I would say it's a hind call, it's not a, or does, not stags, but uh, we'll see now, I'm, uh, I'm here on my red permission and uh, there's a stag here, I have a stag, a big stag that I saw, which uh, made me come again just in case. Just in case, you know what I mean? Um, if he's in a good condition, it's not the best time, as I said, they start to cast their antlers. I might, I might take it, we'll see how it goes. Um, but anyway, it's a good, uh, it's a good lease, it's a good permission here. Um, usually I come here um, before the first light, because I have a walk to do for about 10-15 minutes so it'll be, it's just a prime time when I arrive there to make my plan for stalking but it doesn't matter at the end of the day we are here we'll enjoy the the morning so we'll see how it goes so theoretically it was meant to rain today but uh, it is not so that's a good thing I'll be trying to make my way to the stocking spot a little bit faster because uh, I don't really want to lose precious time but in the same time I don't want to rush because uh, who knows what am I, what am I meet along the way it is beautiful clear sky you can ask for better than that everything is wet soaking wet but uh, that's how it is and much anyway there's a nice tag here I saw it last December just before the season closed um, man I met him once about 8 yards and, but uh, the wind changed and uh, this man is straight away so anyway stay tuned hopefully we see something so we'll get something on the footage um, and I hope uh, you don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the videos. Man, it's beautiful. Need to check the wind first. Not much wind, but uh, it should have blown different direction as per the app. I don't know, but uh, It's a lot of brush, so I have to take my time and scan properly and we'll make our way up slowly. When we are still far from the the hot spot, but uh, they could be anywhere.
a massive here. Huge. You're safe, boy. Spotted some sika deer. Now they are far. They are actually on one of my other permissions, but um, they are in the thickness. And to get there, it'll be just a pain in the ass. They are easily 800 yards from here. I would say. Don't know if I'll be able to to capture something with the camera, but I'll try to zoom in and see if. Uh, See if you can see anything. Okay. Oh. There she is. There are about six. I think I saw with my binos. Not bad. Get the binos back just to see if that's a sea color of red. It looks like it looks like a color of a red, but I haven't seen their reds only sika. She's nice. Let me have a look closer. <laughs> they are red. <laughs> Bloody hell. They are about six or seven red deer. There. And all that stick. To shoot one there, like <laughs> you don't want that. That's for sure. I leave them away. I will leave them go, and will make my. I'll make my, I'll make my way up because uh, it seems like they they do feed. They're out feeding, so I might see them on the other side also. Let me see how the wind is here. Did it change? <laughs> Just oh, oh, that's perfect. That's a good wind, and the, for the direction I go. Anyway. Let's see what uh, what we see there up on the top.
so just a quick update um, just spotted over one of the, the fences spotted the hind and uh, I thought there'll be a stag with the stags I don't think they'll be still knocking around so I shot uh, a mature one she moved when I pulled the trigger now she's dead because I saw her blowing down just here but um and I shot the yearling as well and not bad not morning anyway and it won't be it'll be a bit of a work but uh I'm not going to say there'll be loads and loads of work to be done and trying to pull them it'll be a bit but um, I think I'll manage um, I'll stay put here for a bit see I might actually go a little bit higher and I could see all the valley now the second shot I took it looks skyline but it's not actually it's the valley and then there's a hill so behind that there's nothing there um, no roads no nothing so it's a safe uh, safe backstop um, anyway I was a full hit Perfect shot, and she's big on this one. She's big. Yeah, it was a perfect shot on her as well. Yeah, she's big. smell of gut so perfect man she's big I'll bring the other one on down get some nice pictures then I'll start to process them Oh man, she's a monster. Oh man, oh. nice and clean, so as I said, they're clean, I'm going to go, I need to drop the gear and uh, bring the, bring the jeep closer, I have the, the harness so the harness will help me track them. So 
That is a bit of a walk. Oh man, I might have to put the phone down if I don't want to get anything on the record with me going down. There'll be some work, that's for sure. Not that bad. Let's say about 140 yards. I almost dragged them. There's another hedge. Two hedges actually in total. And that's where the gate is. I think I'll be able to bring the Jeep down to the gate, hopefully, fingers crossed, so I don't have to drag too much. Oh, there's no electricity in. <laughs> I need my notes intact. And I see loads of small tracks. But uh can't see no sea cut. Nothing small. Okay, so not the jeep. I go up. I go slow up and there's another one that I need to go that's a little bit more soft. That's soft actually, not more, that's very soft. But um, I would say it should be okay. Decent soft here. See if I see a gap here in the ditch that would be that would be great can't see much can't see much that's the problem okay okay so I have something here I'll try and see if I can Push them through that gap. I think she's okay to wait until I, until I'll get back. Oh, it's not that bad with the harness. The grass is wet, and they'll slide. Oh man. The small one is there. Penny break my heart. <sighs> She's massive. It's a little. <sighs> Not that far, huh? Where's that tall tree? Behind that tall tree. Oh, they are heavy. One last push and we are done. Okay, folks, so and that's a wrap for me today. Managed to get out easy, no problem. But uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, there's nice footage on. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up. 
and uh, I'm sure there'll be more to come until then stay safe and enjoy hunting until the end of April